Greetings. Hi, I'm Dr. Walter Jacobson, a board-certified psychiatrist. I want to talk about exaggeration. It's, you know, it's a mistake to exaggerate. People exaggerate in order to uh, make their point, in order to emphasize, you know, their issue. But it's a lie. Exaggeration is a lie. It's not accurate. It's not true. When you're going to make your case about something that bothers you, you, you know, you're you're having an argument with a, in a relationship with somebody, and uh, and if you say you always do this to me and and they don't, that's an exaggeration. If the, if you say you never have been there for me and they have been, that's an exaggeration. It's not true and it's not fair. And additionally, what it does is it it. It, de it derails the conversation it uh, because the person who you're uh, unfairly accusing of always uh, doing or never doing something, they get angry. They get very angry at being mischaracterized. And so they start attacking you on your exaggerations, on, your, on you saying things that aren't true. And suddenly you're arguing about uh, the, 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 uh, that. You're arguing about the, the all or never concept. It's much wiser to stick to the facts. Don't exaggerate the truth. So if the fact is that most of the time, just about all the time, not all the time, but just about all the time you do this, or just about all the time you never are there for me, almost never. Uh, occasionally you have been, most of the time you're not. That's my complaint. That's what you want to do. You don't want to exaggerate. It's you know, it's just a bad idea when when you say that there were like 700 people there and there were actually 12. <laughs> you know, no, that's not the way you make your point. That's not the way you try to uh, make your case uh, by uh, distorting the facts. You need to stick to the facts, yeah, and 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 that and that includes not again not mischaracterizing uh, a, a situation by. Uh, by also, uh, you know, being selective about what uh, your recollection of what somebody said. So if uh, if somebody said something to you and you are you got mad and uh, and you are uh, defending your position and you actually don't quote the person accurately, you have distorted what the person uh, said and you're attacking that person based upon what you think they said or what you assume they meant. This is again a, a form of uh, of distortion. Uh, I wouldn't necessarily call it a form of exaggeration, but uh, but yeah, I guess maybe you can. But I think you get the point. Stick to reality. Stick to the facts. If you can't make your case uh, by sticking to the facts, if you if, if you can't make your case without exaggerating and distorting the facts, uh, then uh, you don't have a case. Okay. Stick to the facts, be honorable, be ethical, uh, take the high road, you know, and, uh, and don't distort. Because when you do that, then you're having a conversation about something that actually is not reality. Now you're arguing over fantasy. Uh, and, uh, and, it, and it goes off in, on tangents and uh, you don't get anywhere. So if you want to have a good relationship uh, with somebody, you know, tell the truth, don't exaggerate, don't distort, uh, be honest, be honorable, admit your own mistakes uh, at the same time that you may be pointing out the mistakes of others. Okay, that's it for now. Take care. Peace be with you. See you next time.